Today we're going to demonstrate how to integrate Citrix Analytics for security with Azure Sentinel. There are three parts to successful integration. First is the creation of a log analytics workspace in Azure. Second one is the configuration in the Citrix Analytics portal. And third is the Logstash server installation and configuration. That's not included in today's demo. So let's get started with the log analytics workspace creation in Azure. We're going to log into the Azure portal. And once we're in the portal, you can search for Sentinel and navigate to the Sentinel section. If you don't have a workspace created, you can create one using the Create button and follow the instructions. In this case, we already have a workspace and we're going to be using one of them. Now we're in Microsoft Sentinel, we need to navigate to the Data Connectors link. As part of our partnership with Microsoft, we've created a data connector and published it. You can search for, the, for our Citrix data connector in the search bar. Once the connector appears, click on it. And this will give you a brief description of what the connector is supposed to do, with some versioning information and status. On the right-hand page, you'll see some prerequisites along with licensing agreement. There are two pieces of information that are important here. One is the workspace ID and the other is the primary key. These two pieces of information will be used in the Logstash configuration. So please make a note of this information. Next, we're going to take a look at the SIM configuration in the Citrix Analytics Console. This is the Citrix Analytics Console, and you're going to configure our SIM integration here. Navigate to the Settings and Data Sources pages. And once you're in the Data Sources page, scroll all the way to the bottom to see the SIM Integration Configuration section. Select the three dots and configure the SIM integration. This will take us to this next page. The username here will be pre-populated for you but the password fields will be empty. So you can enter the password of your choosing, and this is going to be used by Logstash to connect to Citrix Analytics. Once you enter the password and click Configure, the backend infrastructure components like the Kafka topic, etc., will be created for you, and this section will be made visible. Since we're config configuring Sentinel, I'll click on the Azure Sentinel tab, and you'll see steps four and five. For this demo, the log test configuration is already completed and verified. But if, it's, if, you're, if, it's, if you don't have one, you're going to need to complete steps four and five. So we've gone through the steps of configuring the log stash server, the integration configuration the Citrix Analytics UI, and the log analytics workspace in Azure portal. Let's see what happened after all of those. Data is now flowing into Sentinel. To see the data, we're going to have to open up one of our workbooks. You could search for the Citrix Analytics Workbook up at the top. Here we'll get a brief description on the workbook. And let's go ahead and open that template. You can see the workbook containing the data corresponding to your Citrix Analytics account. We've gotten data from Citrix Analytics now into Sentinel, and we've plotted our data points. So for example, you could see we have high, medium, and low risk users that are already being categorized. And you could see the risk profile over time. And you could also search for different time ranges. Now let's drill down into two of the individual users details. So for example, we could search for a user over the past 30 days and see what their risk score is. Currently they're at a risk score of 27. And we could see the different types of risks that have been associated and a plot uh, of their logins over a world map. We also get other related information such as their IPs and devices. And this is a result of configuring the integration from the Citrix Analytics into Sentinel. And right now, this is just really a starting point. You can actually import data from other data sources like Palo Alto Networks or F5 to combine the data with the data with Citrix Analytics. This will allow you to get more insights about your risk posture for your company.